Hi, today at Hacks for Mac, I want to show you something I've been asked to show many times, which is how to sign a PDF document. By signing, I mean electronically signing, which means adding your scan signature to a PDF document. As you know, PDF documents are read-only documents, so it's a little hard to manipulate those. Usually what you do is you print those first, you fill them up manually, and then you have to rescan them. Usually the scans are too big to send over email, and the whole hassle just takes uh, a lot of time. People already know how to sign Word documents where it allows you to insert a photo of your scan signature. So I want to show you how to do this on a Mac with a software called PDF Signer. So PDF Signer is a very neat software. It just it does just that. It allows you to fill and execute uh, legal agreements, uh, forms from the IRS. Uh, and I'm going to show you a very quick example of how that works. So I have PDF Signer already installed. Uh, you can find it on the Mac Store. Uh, I will shoot up a non-disclosure agreement or an NDA, which is one of the many types of forms we have to fill um, as we run our business. And you'll notice that, as with any agreement, it has two areas that uh, you need to fill in. The first one is text, which is filling your name, address, etc. And then at the very bottom, usually you have a place for your signature. So we're going to use the two tools here to do exactly that. We'll start with filling up a name and we'll just place the cursor at John Doe. Uh, if we missed the queue, we can rearrange the text. We can also change the size of, of the font and the type of the font if we need to. And you sort of figure out how this works. You can fill out the rest at the very bottom you have the area where you have to add your signature. Over here there's a stamp tool. You select the stamp tool. If you don't already have a, an existing scan signature here, if you're using it for the first time, you'll just click the plus sign, add a, a PNG or a JPEG over your scanned signature. PNGs, by the way, are better because they allow for transparency in the background. This one has transparency. And as you can see, um, it's just selecting it and placing it in the right space. And amazingly enough, this is it. This is all you need to do. Uh, we will save this file as a new PDF. Let's call this done. And we will now open it up with a regular PDF reader. So this is the Adobe Reader. And as you can see, the text that we added is here. It's also selectable, which is kind of nice. And at the very bottom, you will find my scan signature again not as an annotation but rather as an embedded uh, image which is also kind of nice because it looks like I, I was just scanning it and uh, that's it so again my recommendation is to go uh, over to pdfsign.com and or go to the Mac store search up uh, PDF signer and that's how you fill and sign agreements and forms on a Mac thank you